Thank you, sisters and brothers. Uh, inappropriate timing. Uh, my name is Mike McNeil, so I hope you weren't talking about me. Uh, yeah, certainly, we, we, uh, we appeared before our law amendments, and of course, as expected, they made a motion to uh, put it back to the House instead of putting it back to the Department. So that's a shame, of course, to this liberal government. It, uh, it shows a lack of respect and dignity uh, for the very workers that provide the valuable services across this country. Uh, I represent, as President Kubi, uh, Nova Scotia, 18,000 public sector members across the province. And, uh, and uh, I can tell you the voices of our members have been heard loud and clear. Uh, we know that they're going to try to ram this legislation through. But let me tell you, if you think Kubi's going to be solid over the next little while, you're sadly mistaken. Sisters and brothers, as quick as they can come in, they can be booted out, and I think we need to commit ourselves to it. So, sisters and brothers, I ask you today, I know there's lots of speakers here with me, but let me tell you, to be stand shoulder to shoulder with every unionized worker and non-unionized worker to make sure that this government's ousted because their their treatment of workers in general. Not just unionized, but non-unionized, sucks big time. <laughs> That's the best way to go. Thank you, sisters and brothers. had to be there to witness it. It was just absolutely shameful. It's apparent that the liberal MLAs don't know what democracy is. They don't know how to hack on it. They don't know how to chair a friggin' committee in them. <laughs> well, I want to say we're very happy that the teachers' union is here. Now, so you know that the labor moves will be getting together soon. We're going to be planning further actions because this isn't the end. This is just the beginning, and we're going to make sure we make our mission to throw the goddamn McNeil government out of office. We share the memes that we're going to have on Facebook over the next little while. We need to share stuff on social media, and we need members to come out to any actions that we do from here on in over the next two years, because that's the only way we're going to get a message out to this government that the labor movement here. With... Hello. Oh. <laughs> that the labor movement is here. We're united. We're going to stick together, and we're going to fight like hell to make sure democracy is restored in this province. Thank you, sisters and brothers. But we need to be vigilant and we need to let people know that we have rights and they are ours and we will protect them. So, so,
because that takes a long time and a lot of things happen between now and then. But and I'll tell you one thing, we sure as hell surprised the Liberals today because I don't think that they thought that we could pull any kind of a rally together. But we surprised the Liberals today.